like a castaway What we wanted Not what we thought we wanted Louise just tested positive for COVID today or actually yesterday and is very sick. Her speech starts like this. Hello all, I'm Louise, mother of the bride. I am so proud of the beautiful young woman you have grown into. You have filled our lives with such joy. You are always so full of adventure, even from when you were a little girl. I remember your first day of kindergarten. We dropped you off and you ran right into the classroom without even a hug or a goodbye. It was like, catch you later, mom. <laughs> Then you stopped and you remembered. You forgot to do something and you turned around and you waved. I will forever have that image engraved in my memory. Watching, waiting patiently from where riches flow. My heart is sure to follow. See much clearer. Alex, it goes without saying that we are proud of all your accomplishments as a son, student, athlete, and engineer. But we are most proud of the human being that you are. You show us your care for your family and friends every day. You have brought your game obsession to our family during our Sunday family days. On Sundays when you and Steph come over now, our TV magically changes channels to a live stream of a disc golf tournament somewhere in the world. Our chalkboard at home was always blessed with a weekly message about what international day it was on that day. Guess what today is? International Rock, Paper, Scissors Day. So we now come to your vows. So how should you decide to who's gonna go first? Rock, paper, scissors? Yeah. <gasps> so on three. <laughs> so me first or you first? <laughs> I can go first. <laughs> Stephanie, you're my favorite person in the whole world. You're beautiful inside and out, smart and witty when you need to be, caring and compassionate when you don't. And you make me laugh because you are funny despite what I may say otherwise every now and then. You're also the kindest person I've ever met and incredibly thoughtful. I think I speak for many of your close friends when I say that I've never met someone with such a deep impact on so many other people. You mean everything to me, and I know I'm not alone when I say how important you are in my life. I got you! Well, I didn't say it yet. <laughs> no, Did but I? you're like emotional. Well, not really. <laughs> Alex, we both know I can be a very indecisive person, but one thing I have never been uncertain of is love I have for you. And today, I stand here making the easiest decision of my life, which is becoming your wife. It is remembering to say I love you at least once a day. It is at no time taking the other for granted. It is having a mutual sense of values and common objectives. It is standing together facing the world. Hi, Gubby. Hi. You look beautiful. Thank you. Are you crying already? No. <laughs> <laughs> Everything has always felt right with you. These past eight plus years have flown by. You came into my life and just fit right in. Approved right away by my friends and family, it felt like you had always been around. You have shown me what true love is and proved time and time again how much you care about me. I'm not sure a lifetime is enough to return all you've done for me, 
but I'm thankful I get a chance to try. Alex and Steph, your special day is here. Congratulations, wow, I feel like I've been expecting this for years now, and it's so cool to finally be able to say it out loud. It's your wedding day. Just trying to let that sink in. <laughs> I'm so thankful to have grown up with you, to have watched you fall in love with Alex, and to have seen you become the beautiful woman and bride that you are today. I honestly don't think I've seen Steph happier than when she's with Alex. I swear Steph smiles wider when she sees Alex than when she sees the golden M of a McDonald's. <laughs> and believe me, that's a big deal. And I feel like At The Cottage was the first time I actually met Steph and got to know her. And before I could even say hello, she handed me a shot. And it was a shot of Malibu. And at first I was like, who the hell is this? What did Alex bring home? But you know, I took this shot and I felt so included. I just felt amazing. And that's what you do best is bringing people together. Especially when I tell you that I'm bringing you McDonald's merch. actual wedding that we had, um, Alex and Steph came up and had a really nice speech and at the end they presented us with wine that we had made in an adventure to do something together as friends in what they thought was the last bottle. But we saved our last bottle for your wedding. Let's pour this out so we can cheers with the final last bottle of this stuff. So cheers to Alex and Stephanie on a bright and prosperous future together. We love you guys a ton and are so, so happy for the both of you. anticipation and excitement has gone into this beautiful best day ever. But with all this adrenaline, I hope you both get to take a step back, take it all in, feel all the feels, and just sit in the love your family and friends have for you today and always. Love you both.